Uh, Nidhi, um, we, I can see that Priyanka Chaturvedi, I'm on her uh, Twitter feed right now. She's changed her, her description of, of herself. It's, it just says columnist, blogger, sari hoarder, mother, etc., etc. Is this now confirmed that she has quit? Uh, that's right, Sarah. We spoke to sources in the Congress party who have confirmed to NDTV that Priyanka doesn't really resign from all posts and from the primary membership of the Congress party last night. Uh, she sent in her resignation and uh, she is very upset, uh, very unhappy at how uh, the party handled uh, this incident that she had talked about in her tweet the other day that happened in Mathura some months ago where she had gone uh, for a press conference and where uh, members of the party uh, of the local unit there had stormed into her room and, and misbehaved with her. They were in fact suspended uh, from the party and then reinstated just the other day. One of them has even got a parliament ticket and that is what Priyanka Chaturvedi went public with on her Twitter handle just a couple of days ago about how anguished she was uh, with this. And uh, she has taken a conscious decision now, uh, you know, not, uh, not therefore to continue in the party any longer. Uh, Priyanka Chaturvedi uh, has been one of the Congress's most uh, the vocal, most visible spokespersons as a young woman. Uh, she's uh, you know, been very articulate uh, in defending uh, the party's positions on television debates across news channels in Hindi and in English. So she's someone our uh, viewers will be very familiar with night after night. And it is a big loss and embarrassment for the Congress party, really, uh, at many levels, because A, uh, you know, the Congress will have to explain uh, why it allowed uh, these men, uh, uh, you know, to be reinstated in the party for, uh, you know, for, for what was, you know, a, a, an attempt to virtually molest Priyanka Chaturvedi. Uh, the Congress will have to explain, uh, you know, why it, it allowed that to happen. And it has lost now one of its most visible, articulate spokespersons. Uh, and, and therefore, uh, that is a huge embarrassment in the middle of the Congress campaign, Sarah. Certainly is, uh, Nidhi Razan. Thanks for that update.